Hey guys, it's May May, and it's time for our original Stamp Club reveal for April of 2023. Can you believe it? April? Seriously, did we blink and a quarter of the year is almost gone? This set is so perfect for April, for this time of year, and it does two things for me. One, it gives me all the feels for spring, but it also gives me something that I can put things in. I love stamp sets that have something that I can load up with things and make part of my card or whatever my project is, and that's what this one does. Now, if you're watching today and you're not a member of our stamp club, you're missing out. I'm gonna be honest with you, it's a really good opportunity, especially if you're a beginner trying to collect your stamps, this is a good way to do it. So our stamp club is a mystery stamp that comes to you every month. We have two options to choose from, our original, which is this guy, or our scripture club that ships in the middle of the month or the end of the month. All the information for joining is listed below, but it's a very affordable option to collect some stamps and a cool way to get something new and fresh every month in your mailbox. Okay, let's get started. I'm super excited. So this little guy here is called a happy hello. Isn't this so cute? I just love this. This wagon is going to get used for everything. Wagon, cart, whatever you want to use it for. Do you see this little piece of wood? It has a little nail mark right there. That is so you can use it like a little um, handle. So if you want to stamp this guy and then stamp him and put him where he's like going back like this, you can. If you want to attach him to something or just have that little handle kind of there on the wagon, that's what he's for. But he's just a piece of wood. You could use him for all kinds of stuff. You could even make a background out of that. Look at the flowers, they're so cute. And when I asked for these flowers of Sylvia, I said, here's what I want. I want easy to color, lots of space, okay? So that's what she did. She gave me big old flowers that are super simple to color to do some shading and things in because sometimes our flowers can get a little too tiny and too detailed and I love that. Then I wanted flower pots, another thing to put things in. I love that. I think these are so cute. So we got some, what I call like terracotta pots, right? How about this? When I saw this, I was like, are you kidding me? First off, I think you can make a creature out of it, number one. But it is a topsoil or a seed packet or a bag, right? I think it is so cute. Then you came to my mind and made me smile. Hello. And then there's the words there. Buttercup, beautiful, my friend, sweetness, a happy for hello. Darling, lovely to you. Seeds here and topsoil here that fit inside of your bag and an extra flower just in case you need to put one by the wheel or around something or even just a single stem coming out of the pot. Let's look at my samples. Mine, I should say our samples, mine and Shannon's. I love this uh, stamp set. And I told Shannon, I said, this is the most Shannon card I think I've ever made. I did this one and I had a lot of fun doing it and a lot of fun coloring. It was super fun to take my Nouveau markers and try to come up with terracotta. That's what I did there. It took three colors for me to get it, but I think I got pretty close. And then I love this little topsoil bag. Are you kidding me? How cute is that? What a cute card to send to somebody in the spring just to say, hello, my friend, right? Let's look at my other one. Now this one, I had a lot of fun doing. This is like a window card that stands on its own and it's just done with that little easel mechanism on the side there. You can see I glued two little seed bags into the inside and then I just did my wagon up with all the pretty little pieces and something I wanna show you. This is that American Crafts um, white cardstock that has a texture to it and I loved coloring it so much. Look how it almost looks like a new technique of coloring. I use color pencils and I just kind of colored like I normally would, but I love the texture that I got on there. I think it looks really cool. And if we turn it over, you came to my mind and made me smile. I had to use all of those. I thought that was so cute. And then Shannon's is adorable. Ready for this? Look at her little card she did. She used the grass dye to get these little guys here. Her little flower pots all stacked up. Her, all the little pots inside her cart. How cute are those, right? And she told me to tell you that the clouds that she used came from our stamp set called Define Emotion. So if you already have that, that's where she got those little clouds from. But there's more, look on the inside. You came to my mind and made me smile. Look how cute, right? Love this set. There's so many different ways to use it. One thing we didn't show you, which I really think is important for me to point out, is this. The flowers, the way that Sylvia created them, let me get the stamp set. 
the way Sylvia created them, you are able to stamp them without the pots and you can stamp them in succession. So if you want to do a line of flowers down your card or if you wanted to put flowers around a frame or something like that, you could use these for that. You don't have to just put them in the pots and I think that's really, really cool. All right, guys, that is our set for April. How cute, right? I love it. I think this guy right here would be cute with Easter eggs in him, with packages in him, with animals in him, critters. Who knows? You can put anything in that little wagon. Thanks so much for being a part of our club. By the way, every month around this time, we give away a $50 gift card. And if you would like to enter to win next month, all you have to do is make a project using this stamp set um, post that project, a photo of that project on our customer gallery at maymaymadeit.com and you're entered to win. The winner from last month will be listed in the first line of the description of this video. So congratulations to that winner. And thank you guys for being a part of our club. And until next time, bye now.